Pope Francis on the 22nd of March 2020 said in these days of trial while humanity trembles at the threat of the pandemic i would like to propose to all christians to unite their voices to heaven let us be united as catholics fully engaged in the battle against the coronavirus pandemic armed with our greatest weapon the holy rosary in the name of the father and the son and the holy spirit amen holy mary mother of mercy and of hope graciously hear our prayers i believe in god the father almighty creator of heaven and earth and in jesus christ his only son our lord who was conceived by the holy spirit born of the virgin mary suffered under pontius pilate was crucified died and was buried he descended into hell and on the third day he rose again from the dead he ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of god the father almighty from thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead i believe in the holy spirit the holy catholic church the communion of saints the forgiveness of sins the resurrection of the body and life everlasting amen our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil for an increase in devotion to holy mary mother of god virgin most powerful virgin most merciful healer of the sick comforter of the afflicted hope of the hopeless and comforter of the dying we pray hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee blessed are you amongst women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee blessed are you amongst women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee blessed are thou amongst women and blessed is the fruit of your womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen today let us reflect on the five luminous mysteries the first luminous mystery the baptism of jesus jesus the pure holy and sinless son of god humbled himself to be baptized by john just as the holy spirit descended upon jesus at his baptism he comes to us too at ours let us respond to the promptings of the holy spirit to bring the love of jesus to others and to pray fast and work to alleviate suffering while begging god for an end to this pandemic our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil during this mystery we shall pray for church leaders and governments facing the challenge of the corona virus holy mary mother of good counsel bless and protect our holy father pope francis may your holy spirit the paraclete guide him to be astute in leadership wise in dealing with the world humble in shepherding his flock and courageous in carrying out the will of god during the corona virus pandemic holy mary mother of good counsel bless and protect the cardinals bishops priests deacons religious sisters seminarians and all clergy 
Holy Mary, Mother of Good Counsel, strengthen our church leaders with fortitude and give them the endurance to pursue their holy vocations faithfully. Holy Mary, Mother of Good Counsel, pray that kings, queens, presidents and government leaders in all countries act courageously and trust God in their decision making in curbing the spread of the coronavirus. Holy Mary, Mother of Good Counsel, be with all civil leaders making decisions that affect the lives and futures of our families, communities and the world at large. Holy Mary, Mother of Good Counsel, help all those in leadership to communicate their messages regarding the coronavirus clearly, truthfully and honestly with each other and the public. Holy Mary, Mother of Good Counsel, pray that world leaders will put the needs of their people ahead of their own agendas and foster peace and goodwill. Holy Mary, Mother of Good Counsel, help all leaders in business to collaborate in the provision of masks, protective clothing, sanitizers, ventilators and even finance to help governments cope with the needs of the coronavirus patients. Holy Mary, Mother of Good Counsel, guide civil groups to work wholeheartedly in aiding all who need food, shelter, medical assistance and basic needs. Holy Mary, Mother of Good Counsel, may all church and civil leaders encourage all their members and constituents to obey and support the directives of their governments. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee. The second luminous mystery, the wedding at Cana. Remembering that Jesus performed his first public miracle at the behest of his mother, let us turn to Mary to intercede for an end to this pandemic and help all who are afflicted by it. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. During this mystery, we shall pray for the intention of addressing our actions through repentance and forgiveness. Holy Mary, Mother of Divine Grace, help our religious who have gone astray in their commitment to the Lord. Touch their hearts and awaken their consciences and bring their hearts back to you. Holy Mary, Mother of Divine Grace, we pray for all governments and leaders to realize that they are not all-powerful, but that there is a higher power they must turn to and acknowledge that they do not have all the answers. Holy Mary, Mother of Divine Grace, help us to realize that in many ways we have slipped in our faithfulness and allowed secular and materialistic values to become part of our lifestyle. Holy Mary, Mother of Divine Grace, under the influence of TV and the press and being modern, we have let our guard slip and we allowed greed, unbridled ambition and selfishness to infiltrate our thinking and doing. Holy Mary, Mother of Divine Grace, pray for the conversion of sinners those who do not believe in Jesus and those who do not know Jesus as Saviour and Lord. Holy Mary, Mother of Divine Grace, on behalf of all, we repent and regret the sin of abortion which claims so many lives and has done so long before the coronavirus. 
we ask for god's forgiveness and mercy holy mary mother of divine grace the corona virus has devastated individuals and families but so has violence and abuse racism xenophobia discrimination marginalization of refugees migrants and even the homeless we ask for forgiveness holy mary mother of divine grace we turn to you in this time of fear and uncertainty we plead for your mercy and truth to dwell in us and to show us how to face the challenges posed by the corona virus holy mary mother of divine grace give us the strength and wisdom to stand together in the unity with the whole world to overcome this corona virus pandemic holy mary mother of divine grace cover our planet with the mantle of your protection love and care we feel helpless in the face of this virus and turn to you a mother in our distress we are your children glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen o my jesus forgive us our sins save us from the fires of hell and lead all souls to heaven especially those most in need of thy mercy o mary conceived without sin pray for us who have recourse to thee the third luminous mystery the proclamation of the kingdom of god with a call to repentance as jesus preached about the kingdom of god he called all to repentance and conversion let us all embrace the good news and trust jesus to bring an end to this pandemic and help to all who suffer because of it our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil during this mystery we shall pray to bless and protect all medical staff and support teams dealing with the corona virus holy mary virgin most powerful bless and guide the doctors and nurses as they care for those affected by the corona virus grant them the courage and love to fulfill their duties with diligence and without prejudice holy mary virgin most powerful multiply the supplies of medical equipment needed for them to do their vital work holy mary virgin most powerful inspire scientists in their research to develop better tests to diagnose the corona virus identifying protocols to eliminate the disease spread and the development of an effective vaccine for a lasting cure holy mary virgin most powerful bless all volunteers who care and serve corona virus patients and their families holy mary virgin most powerful strengthen all the essential service staff in order to maintain the basic services required through lockdowns imposed by the corona virus holy mary virgin most powerful be with the leaders of all nations give them the foresight to make the correct decisions to protect their countries of the corona virus holy mary virgin most powerful strengthen the health systems throughout the world especially in the world's poorest countries to fight the corona virus holy mary virgin most powerful help rich nations protect those most at risk especially in poor communities who are struggling to stop the corona virus spreading holy mary virgin most powerful bless all those sharing their financial resources helping all those affected by the corona virus to receive aid holy mary virgin most powerful bless all those who pray and fast 
uniting their petitions to God to combat the coronavirus. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee. The fourth luminous mystery, the transfiguration. Peter, James and John witnessed the glory of Christ's transfiguration and it inspired in them awe and holy terror. May our eyes be opened to see Jesus in the face of all who are suffering in this pandemic and may it motivate us to try to alleviate their misery in this life and help them find glory in the next. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. During this mystery, we shall pray for families inflicted by the coronavirus. Holy Mary, comforter of the afflicted, stand vigil with family and friends at the sick beds of all those infected by the coronavirus. Holy Mary, comforter of the afflicted, give strength and courage to all coronavirus patients who have tested positive and are in self-isolation. Holy Mary, comforter of the afflicted, have mercy on coronavirus patients who seek your protection. Holy Mary, comforter of the afflicted, protect the elderly and all those with compromised immune systems. Holy Mary, comforter of the afflicted, strengthen and guide the heads of households of coronavirus patients in their efforts to sustain their families. Holy Mary, comfort of the afflicted, intercede for all those infected with the coronavirus and lead them to Jesus your Son. Holy Mary, comfort of the afflicted, be the loving companion of the coronavirus patients who are alone with no one to comfort or support them. Holy Mary, comfort of the afflicted, help families to adjust to being homebound, encouraging them to find comfort in the Lord. Holy Mary, comfort of the afflicted, comfort those whose livelihoods may be threatened because of losing their jobs due to the coronavirus. Holy Mary, comfort of the afflicted, unite families and communities in daily mass, prayers and fasting to break the coronavirus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee. The fifth luminous mystery, the institution of the Eucharist. At the Last Supper, Jesus instituted the Eucharist, changing bread and wine into his very self, his own body, blood, soul and divinity. The Eucharist is the source and summit of Christian life and it gives us the most tangible connection to our Saviour. It is to the Eucharist that we fly to pour out our heart to him who loves us infinitely. As St. Peter Julian Amat said, Until we have a passionate love for our Lord in the most blessed sacrament, we shall accomplish nothing. Let us go to adore our Eucharistic Lord and beg him to end this pandemic and bring healing to all the afflicted. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, 
as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil during this mystery we shall pray for comforting survivors and victims of the coronavirus holy mary mother of mercy help all the families who have lost their loved ones during the coronavirus pandemic holy mary mother of mercy we pray for all those who at this moment have a loved one dying from the coronavirus holy mary mother of mercy grant eternal rest to all doctors nurses and other caregivers who have died sacrificing their lives in attending to their coronavirus patients holy mary mother of mercy be with the families that have just lost their loved ones to the coronavirus console their hearts take the dearly departed by the hand into your kingdom holy mary mother of mercy help those who are suffering in fear dying afraid alone without family holy mary mother of mercy console strengthen and encourage us in this time of fear doubt and confusion caused by the coronavirus pandemic holy mary mother of mercy be with the families of those who are sick or who have died as they worry and grieve defend them from illness and despair may they know your peace holy mary mother of mercy we pray for the eternal rest of all those who have died from the virus may the lord of mercy forgive their sins they have suffered so much and may they now rest in peace holy mary mother of mercy we pray for all those dying this day let them now not die in despair or fear mother mary be there for them whether they know you or not holy mary mother of mercy we ask that you accept the petitions of this rosary present them to the father of mercy and ask jesus your son to strengthen us by the power of the spirit to face this pandemic with quiet faith trust and confidence knowing that you are on our side glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen o my jesus forgive us our sins save us from the fires of hell and lead all souls to heaven especially those most in need of thy mercy o mary conceived without sin pray for us who have recourse to thee hail holy queen mother of mercy hail our life our sweetness and our hope to you do we cry poor banished children of eve to you do we send up our sighs mourning and weeping in this veil of tears turn then most gracious advocate your eyes of mercy towards us and after this i exile show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb jesus o clement o loving o sweet virgin mary pray for us o holy mother of god that we may be made worthy of the promises of christ let us pray o god whose only begotten son by his life death and resurrection has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life grant we beseech thee that meditating upon these mysteries of the most holy rosary of the blessed virgin mary we may both imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same christ our lord amen may the divine assistance remain always with us and may the souls of the faithfully departed through the mercy of god rest in peace amen pray to saint michael the archangel Saint Michael the archangel defend us in battle be our safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil may god rebuke him we humbly pray and do thou o prince of the heavenly host by the power of god cast into hell satan and all the evil spirits who prowl through the world seeking the ruin of souls amen the memorare Remember O most gracious virgin Mary that never was it known that anyone who fled to thy protection 
implored the help or sought the intercession was left unaided inspired by this confidence i fly unto thee o virgin of virgins my mother to thee do i come before thee i stand sinful and sorrowful o mother of the word incarnate despise not my petitions but in thy mercy hear and answer me amen pray to the virgin mary holy mother of god we turn to you for protection listen to our prayers and help us in our needs glorious and blessed virgin save from every danger those afflicted with the corona virus mother of mercy healer of the sick grant that all for whom we pray will be corona virus survivors amen let us pray grant we beseech you o lord god that we your servants may enjoy lasting health of mind and body and by the glorious intercession of the blessed mary ever virgin be delivered from present sorrow and enter into the joy of eternal happiness through christ our lord amen for the intentions of the holy father our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from all evil hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee blessed are you amongst women and blessed is the fruit of your womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen anima christi soul of christ sanctify me body of christ save me blood of christ inebriate me water from the side of christ wash me passion of christ strengthen me o good jesus hear me within thy wounds hide me suffer me not to be separated from thee from the malignant enemy defend me at the hour of my death call me and bid me come to thee that with thy saints i may praise thee forever and ever amen the divine praises blessed be god blessed be his holy name blessed be jesus christ true god and true man blessed be the name of jesus blessed be his most sacred heart blessed be jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar blessed be the great mother of god mary most holy blessed be a holy and immaculate conception blessed be the name of mary virgin and mother blessed be saint joseph her most chaste spouse blessed be god in his angels and in his saints prayer of thanksgiving father in heaven creator of all and source of all goodness and love look upon us with your infinite kindness and receive our thanks for all the spiritual and temporal blessings that you bestow on each of us we are mindful that because of the sin committed against you by our first parents in the garden of eden we no longer are perfect reflections of your image and likeness because of our human condition we suffer diseases of both mind and body in your infinite kindness and mercy you have given us your own mother as queen of heaven and our hope we offer thanks for your gift of the blessed virgin mary who intercedes for us as we pray for a cure of the corona virus in your kindness and mercy you give us skilled and dedicated doctors scientists and researchers who work hard in the pursuit of a cure for the corona virus for their lives we thank you o lord in your kindness and mercy you give loving and compassionate caregivers in both hospitals and homes to those who suffer from the corona virus for their lives we thank you o lord 
in your kindness and mercy you give supportive family and friends to those who suffer from the corona virus for their lives we thank you o lord in your kindness and mercy o lord you have heard our prayers and cured the corona virus of many for these blessings we thank you o lord in your kindness and mercy o lord you have heard our prayers and have placed in remission the corona virus of many for these blessings we thank you o lord in your kindness and mercy o lord you have heard our prayers and have granted significant achievement in the corona virus treatment of many for these blessings we thank you o lord in your kindness and mercy o lord you promise the gift of eternal salvation to those who take up their cross and follow your son our lord jesus christ for this opportunity we thank you o lord amen glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen